Next morning, I tried to get out of bed and, and I, I was reaching for my water and uh, everything just went numb like. Unfortunately for Mr. Horde, the doctors in the emergency room failed to spot the multiple fractures in his x-rays and they missed his broken back. So they sent Mr. Horde home. Overnight, his life changed forever. Left untreated, his broken back damaged his spinal cord, paralyzing him from the waist down. An Ohio law that limits how much doctors have to pay for their negligence stripped the hordes of a big portion of their award. Without ever hearing a word of testimony, Without ever meeting the hordes, the legislators that passed this law overruled the jury who had heard all of the testimony in the hordes case. Talking about the jury, they worked so hard. They took notes all the time. They paid attention. And I, I think what, what they decided should be what what happens never again to play golf never again to dance with his wife his life was shattered because of the doctor's errors the jury took two days to decide on a fair amount to compensate mr hort for being paralyzed but the law that limits jury awards took away more than two-thirds of his award one of the hardest things for me to cope with was after being married to him for 60 years and sleeping in the same bed with him for 60 years. But he sleeps out here and I sleep in, my, in the bedroom. That, that was the hardest thing for me to get used to. Well, I don't know how the, the jury system works, but uh, I do think that uh, I would rather have eight people deciding my fate as to have one. You gotta, you gotta uh, rely on your fellow man and your fellow, fellow uh, people in your cities and country to do the right thing.